Hello, this is Gray Hughes. I am going to be doing an update right now on the Timothy Cunningham case. Um, there's been a decomposed body that's been found that has a possibility of being him. It was a, an adult male that they found, okay? Now, I just did a live video a little bit ago, but it, again, like sometimes these lives go so far off the path that they aren't related to the title of the video, okay? So this is just gonna be the update that I wanted people to see, okay? Now, here's an article by the, um, looks like the Atlanta Journal-Constitution, I think that's what they call it, um, AJC.com, a body found in uh, Chattahoochee River in Northwest Atlanta, okay? Crews found a body in a portion of the Chattahoochee River that runs near Donald Lee uh, Hollowell Parkway in northwest Atlanta, Fire Sergeant Cortez Stafford said. The body was found at about 9 p.m. Tuesday. It is believed to be that of an adult male, Channel 2 Action News reported. Officials have not said how long the body had been there or what tipped them off to it being in the river. Crews are still working to recover the body and said that there is no definitive timeline for recovery, Atlanta Police Officer Stephanie Brown said. Atlanta Police homicide investigators are also working the scene, which is near the Atlanta Public Safety Annex. Okay, I thought that was weird that, you know, Timothy, Timothy Cunningham, who works for the CDC, and then they find a body by the Atlanta Public Safety Annex, okay? I'm not sure if... You know, that's just a coincidence or, or what, but that's pretty strange, right? Okay, so let's take a look at this. All right, so it says Donald Lee Holloway Parkway and also the, um, where is that? The Atlanta Public Safety Annex, okay? So I've, I've already found that, and that's right here, okay? So this is that road that I just mentioned. Right, so that would be the Donald Lee Hollowell Parkway, right? That's exactly what that road is right there. And the Atlanta, Poli uh, let's see, that's not what it is. The Atlanta Public Safety Annex, okay? So let me just put that into Google Earth and you'll see that it's right there, watch. Okay, so it's this building right there. But the body was found in the river near there. Okay, so maybe, you know, along in this area right here, okay? So that's the Chattahoochee River. All right, now look at this. Timothy Cunningham lived right here, all right? Now let's do a quick uh, fly uh, measurement here, on the fly here. 2.89 miles, okay? So not even three miles. And this river right here flows in this direction, like this, okay? So a body placed up here would float downstream, and this body was highly decomposed. Now, look at this. The river, in this position, or this location, is only 0.5 miles, 0.55 miles from his house. So literally just like a half mile is the river, okay? Now look at this interesting little uh, move here. My mouse seems to be making a lot of noise. All right, so this is actually a train track right here. You remember me mentioning the train tracks that he could cross over here? Well, look at this. The train track actually crosses the river right there, which again, isn't very far from his house, but look how you would actually get there. All right, so let's go to Street View. And here is Timothy Cunningham's home right here. Now watch. You go down this direction. Okay, I'll speed it up just by clicking. So you would just go down this street right here. So it's not far at all to get to those train tracks in this, this uh, direction right here. So right at this intersection up here, you can even see the train tracks. You, you just walk this direction and there's a train tracks that are right back there, but you can't see it from that angle. But let's, 
keep going up here and right here I'm gonna turn and see this ramp right there you can just walk up this ramp and then get onto those train tracks all right and then once you get up on those train tracks which are uh, let's see where is that okay so what we were just looking at was that you walk you walk down the street go this direction get up onto the train track so you go up this ramp that's right here get up on the train tracks and you could literally just walk along the tracks and there's the river right there and I don't know if he killed himself or not but if let's say he jumped off this bridge right here he'd land in the water and then you know over time maybe just floats down the stream okay and now you can see that the river flows in that direction based on where the the white water is it's always on the left side and it's always on the downstream of rocks all right so you know he was found just two and a half or you know when I say he there was a body found I don't know if it's Timothy Cunningham's body though this just seems like a really good candidate to be all right, so the body was found somewhere in this area right here. And it's a male, highly decomposed body. The body is 2.8 miles from Timothy Cunningham's home, which is downstream from a river that's only a half mile from his house. Okay, so that's the update that we have right now. And I do not have any other indication at all if that's him or not. It just seems like a very good possibility, okay? So I appreciate you watching the video, and I'm hoping he's still alive out there. But uh, it, would, it would also be good to actually have some closure in the case and figure out what actually happened to him, all right? So until next time, I hope everybody's safe out there, and I'll talk to you later.